A few moments later. We interrupt your regular programming for this breaking news. A companion hollow has suddenly appeared on 14th Street and has already breached level 3 containment. The Hollow Investigative Association has dispatched a team to the scene to carry out emergency protocol. Evacuation of residents in nearby block is underway. Please stay away from the 14th Street area. Wise, come check this out. What's that? 14th Street? I think the news mentioned it earlier. Give me a sec. Yeah, in the Janus Quarter. They say it's already breached the level 3 controls. Yeah, public security were conducting a manhunt over there today. Evacuations may not be going as expected. So you're saying? We should get ready. We'll be seeing some business coming our way soon. A few moments later. Cool. Now we play the winning game.
Miguel Silver. Everyone should remain vigilant. I am pissed! And this station's reporter, I can't listen to this anymore! Those criminals need to get As soon as we find them, we should just get them all! And then them again! Excuse me, Mr. Reporter, I'm still giving a briefing on the case. Let me... Ugh. I don't give a mother... Listen here, you red bank mother... Don't think the hollow can protect you. The public security's air force is on the way. You're... Is that right, officer? There's a window! Boss, we can get out this way! <sighs> but that's a hollow down there. Fine, a way out is a way out. Can you break the glass, Billy? Easy! Leave it to me! Ugh. It bounced off. This glass must be tough. Damn, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. This window is... Reinforced bulletproof glass. <laughs> You won't be able to break it. The cunning hairs. Dog job agency! <laughs> Why? Why would you steal from the Red Fang Gang? <laughs> My men went through so much trouble to. <laughs> returning it to its rightful owner. Hey, don't make it sound like we're the bad guys. We're all trying to get by on the same streets. Why? Why would you be helping the cops? <laughs> Sorry, but it's not public security that commissioned us. And also, that's none of your business anyway. Of course it is. They had people steal from my territory so i have to teach them a lesson <laughs> why don't you just give it back to me it's so important to us that i'm willing to exchange it for your lives so you need the whole gang armed and ready to handle three people this is the silver tears <laughs> It's even weirder than the rumors. Wait, is that a flashbang? Correct. It's a GS2 High Lumen military flashbang. The blast is quite strong. Awesome! Time to wake up, Billy! What? Eyes open, everyone! Say cheese! Choose to resist? In that case, I have no choice but to kill you all! <laughs> You've made a mistake, mister. We aren't your enemy. That is. Falcon 4 to Commander, we've arrived at the source of the light and found the Red Fang Gang. Repeat, we found the Red Fang Gang. Awaiting orders. Boss, it's the Air Force! That flashbang just now, it was to attract the helicopter! You finally noticed? Now it's your turn to choose, you cry baby. You can stay and fight us, and then get caught by public security. Or you can run, and we all get to live. Damn you, cunning hairs! It's in a hare's nature to avoid getting caught. Don't hold it against me. What? You found the Red Fang? Then what are you waiting for, Commander? Pick the biggest gun and rain down justice! Falcon 4, attack order received. We're done.
done for. Confirmed. We've fallen into a hollow. Let's get going. An ethereal. That was quick. This is the old Metro Junction. If that's the case, then this must be the Cretan Hollow. <clears throat> Good. Headset still works, and the recording function is normal. <clears throat> this is Anby Damara, a member of the Odd Job Agency, the Cunning Hairs. I accidentally fell into a companion hollow. I don't have a carrot or proxy support. Probability of getting lost in the hollow is at 96.4%. I will be making a voice log of my experience. Let it serve as evidence for future investigation in the case I am killed or turned into a monster by the ether. Ambi's Hollow Survival Log Number One. From my surroundings, I can confirm this is the old Metro Junction area of the Cretan Hollow. The Metro Hollow's terrain is inherently complex. My chances of being rescued will be reduced by 37.8% if I don't consider my next step carefully. If anyone doubts the nature of the hollow's spatial distortions, please use my recording as proof of their danger. Please don't enter a hollow unless you are a professional investigator. Otherwise... Uh, there you are, Envy! Great! I knew you'd be okay! Whoa, whoa! Hey! What's gotten into you? You almost cut me! I've met another being of reason. He looks a lot like my colleague, Billy Kidd. What are you talking about? It's me! Billy! An investigator has previously encountered ethereals who can mimic human speech and behavior. The investigator rescued the ethereal pretending to be their teammate, but once they got out of the hollow, it revealed itself. The city made a huge sacrifice, but it was unable to defeat the monster. It was only thanks to a courageous investigator who gave his life to drive the monster back into the hollow that the danger was averted. Come on, the ethereal would be done for the minute it left the hollow. Wait, isn't that the plot of that movie that was in theaters not long ago? There was a long list of victims involved in the incident. I read all their names. That's called a cast list! Question, who would you most 
most like to have dinner with? Huh? Dinner? <laughs> of course. That'd be the big screen superheroes! <laughs> the Starlight Knights! Wait, wait, wait! Put your blade down! I'll tell you! <sighs> it's really the late night drama actress from... Oh, sweetie. Monica. <laughs> All clear. The individual has been confirmed as the real Billy Kid. Meeting Billy Kid increases my chances of survival by over 67.8%. I'm glad you're okay, Billy. I told you I'm me! It's been a while since we fell. Nicole must be trying to come up with a way to get us out from the outside. But... will she be willing to pay for the help? You know how Nicole is. <laughs> Based on Nicole's tight-fisted spending habits, I'd say your original analysis is likely correct. Damn. Now you've got me worried. Let's not get carried away. We have to work together to get through this. As usual, you take the front, and I'll provide fire support from behind. Right. Nothing personal. We're regular people. You're monsters. We're destined to be enemies. I'll aim for your weak spot. It won't hurt. The 
strong box is right at his feet. Uh, you're right! Awesome! Saves us the hassle of searching for it. Slow down, Ambi. What are you gonna do? Catch him, then recover the strong box. Just wait. I never destroy all! Yep, looks like ether corruption. This mutation is so intense. I don't think this guy has any ether aptitude at all. Destroy! Get! Take! His consciousness is still holding on. It's too late. Ether crystals are forming all over his body. He's already. Mutated. <sighs> this guy's a tough one. Ampy, get ready. Roger that.
Hey! Listen up! I was there when that explosion took place! This is an emergency! Billy, Anvy, and the target of my commission have fallen into that hollow. I need a proxy's help now! Hello, Nicole. It'd be nice of you to knock next time. I feel like I hear of your urgent needs at least three times a month, Nicole. You can make fun of me all you want after you help me deal with this crisis. Please, legendary proxy Faithin. What, what trouble, trouble did, did you, you get, get yourself, yourself into, into this time? I just checked. Doesn't look like there's anyone suspicious outside. Don't worry. I wasn't followed. It took a lot to get out of 14th Street unnoticed, but I made sure nobody was tailing me. I hope so. I know things have been tight lately with the general election just around the corner. They're really cracking down on proxies. They set up a hotline and... Okay, Nicole. As long as you get it. We can get down to business. I need you for an important commission. With pay. So Billy and Anby fell into a hollow. I have to get them out. And I need to get back what I've been commissioned to deliver. It's an emergency and you're the only ones who can help. Why don't you make a rescue application with the Hollow Investigative Association? I... don't want to make us a target for the Association right now. If they found we'd been involved in Hollow raiding, we'd be in big trouble. And it'd take a small fortune to pay those greedy vultures off. But I can't just abandon my squad, right? Leaving employees behind... That does sound a lot like Nicole's style. Hey, don't be mean! I allocate a large portion of our revenue to the employee rescue budget. Look, all in all, my request is simple. All you need to worry about is getting my people and my client's stuff out of the hollow safely. You don't accept basic proxy work now? Faithen, finish this job, and I'll clear my entire bill in one go. Okay, just this once. Still no good? Then I'll add... Huh? You'll do it? Come on, you should have had out for that bonus, bro. Great! There's no time to waste! I'll be waiting for you in the hollow. Uh -uh. Nicole, are you hurt? You should stay and rest a while before heading back out. But... Ugh. Just listen to my brother. We'll also need your help to take Eo somewhere close to the Hollow later. Oh... Deploying your Bang Boo double, huh? Okay. Bro, how about you tend to Nicole's wound first? I'll go debug the HDD and help you with the prep work to infiltrate the Hollow. Well then, let's get down to business.
Hello? Can you hear me, Nicole? <gasps> you can put Eos through now. Okay. Right, little one. Off you go, oh then. God. Done. Bang Boo's on the way. <laughs> so... Can we start it up? We're gonna break. I propose now is a good time to take a break. Is that acceptable, Proxy? You all rest. I'll take the first watch. Thanks, Proxy. Whew. That was dangerous. It's crazy what a powerful monster that Red Fang dude mutated into. It's all thanks to you, manager! You got us out of there in the nick of time! As expected from Faithen, reliable as always! A few more compliments like that, and I might just give you a discount. Really? I think the proxy was just trying to be polite, Ambi. Speaking of the commission fee, I thought with faith in being so expensive, Nicole would have left us to fend for ourselves. I didn't think she'd actually hire you. If you hadn't come, I'm afraid we wouldn't have made it out of that ethereal's territory. Thanks for coming to the rescue. Speaking of which, I've always wanted to ask you about that device in your store. You know, the one that lets you sync with Bang Boo and communicate in real time within Hollow. That's some serious tech! Even public security and the Hollow Investigative Association can't do it. With a trump card like that, why didn't you just join the association? Whatever way you look at it, working with us Hollow Raiders has to be more dangerous than the profit is worth. That sounds like an ethereal. Ugh, so soon? I only just sat down. We have to get out of here. Unless, Billy, you'd like to stay here forever? That new Starlight Night Belt you wanted. I guess I'll place it at your grave next year. When you say things like that with that poker face of yours, I can't tell if you're joking or not! Let's get moving. Follow me. Leave any combat along the way to us. <laughs> you just focus on leading the way. Of course, it'd be nice if you lend a hand if battles get a little too intense. I've located the closest exit. Take the path on the right, Wise. Please, manager, lead the way. There are no ethereals on our tail. Let's keep pushing to the exit. Hello, observation data. 
The more the better. Please, manager, lead the way. Try this! My turn. I've got plenty of bullets! Try New enemies incoming. Don't let your guard down. What should we do? Fight. It's cool. Just come with me. This trackling machine. We can use this. It'll be faster if we keep to the track. Scanning for safety valve data. The system log shows that the valve is unlocked by inserting the preset amount of gear coins. I've got goosebumps. It's so powerful. Can you even get goosebumps, Billy? It's a metaphor, all right. Let's just focus on the enemy. Let's clear him out. Confirmed. We save now. Increased. They're getting violent. 
Be careful. In my sight! I've got plenty of bullets! Feel the ultimate Starla! You're here! Perfect timing! That was fast, Nicole. Did you run a red light again? No. We just passed a normal green light. R255 in the RGB scale. Oh, right! I made sure I wasn't followed the whole way. Andy, what does an R255 green light look like? It's the same color as your jacket. Nicole, they've both been extracted. I guess it's time to pay up. Not so fast. That's not what we agreed on. The commission was my people and the client's item. You've only completed the first half. Don't worry, Nicole. We remember. It's just a joke. I knew Faithen was the most reliable and trustworthy. According to what we saw before extraction, the Strongbox should be in the territory of a highly dangerous ethereal. The White Star Institute has it registered as Dullahan, a superior ethereal. That's the one! That Red Fang dude was unlucky. 
His ether corruption must have been pretty intense, considering he's become such a dangerous ethereal. Anvi and I tried to grab the strong box, but that guy was so tough! We didn't get the chance before we got extracted. We did find this along the way, though. What exactly is in that box? Is it worth all this effort? Mm-hmm. We'll find out soon enough. <laughs> Take a look at this. That's a nice piece of jewelry, thanks. But it isn't enough to cover the debt. What are you talking about? It's a mini storage device. It's Silver's. I picked it up in the building before I got out of 14th Street. I noticed it before. He always had it on his person, so it must contain something important. <laughs> I bet it has something to do with a strong box. But it suffered some damage. Yeah, look at all those burn marks. Faithen, can you do some of your mm, magic using that complicated computer of yours? The HDD is mainly used to process hollow data. But if we only need to export what's in the flash drive... <gasps> hey, bro, maybe I could try to recover the data with the proxy network's computing power. Great, it's a deal then. We'll try to locate the strong box in the hollow. We'll come find you when we learn something new. Let's just go our separate ways until then. Oh, don't forget to extract the data from the flash drive, though. See ya, manager. Goodbye.